Sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you don't. Um, enjoy's got nuts. Mounds don't. Don't talk about your nuts. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex scene. It's up, Corbin. I'm Rick. And he calls it Instagram. It's like a juicy content. It's so juicy. Oh, it's going Description below. <laughs> my favorite kind of monster. Vampire. Cool. Uh, you know what's my least favorite kind of monster? Your mom. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Today... Uh, we zombie. Are, no. Oh, yeah. We are doing a zombie. It's old, my least favorite kind of old character. song by um, old friend. His name, uh, Muhammad Rafi, who we heard many of his songs. Yeah, he's one of the most legend. He's legend also really, really old, uh, like old school Bollywood. Um, we've seen quite a few of his songs, but this is a live song of his. Cool. So it's really old, uh, but it's called. Yeah, we're in, when is this from? Uh, Suhani Rak Dal Chuki. Uh, and it's with Nashid. I don't know who that is. Uh, let me see if I can tell you the year. Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, it was uploaded. That's not when it was recorded, no. right? <laughs> no. Because I think it's in black and white. Everything was. You know, there was a certain period of time. I don't know if everybody realizes this, but when the world was in black and white. That's true. That's why they, you know, when they were filming, they were really capturing what things looked like. I think, I don't know if every kid goes through it, but the moment you realize that the world actually wasn't that yeah and then <laughs> when they I, invented color and i'm not a big fan of colorization mm -hmm. but there's one world war ii documentary that has been put into color and it absolutely puts you closer to it makes it feel much closer because world war ii feels like that was that might as well have been the ancient romans it feels yeah. that long ago yeah but when you see it in color you realize well, that wasn't that long ago yeah. yeah all right here we go you'll probably recognize his voice when you hear it Wow. Yeah, uh, 2010. Sorry, there's a little something on screen. Sorry, can't get rid of that. So Thank you. 
तप रहे हैं हम Eating some mangoes and drinking a pina colada. Yeah, um, with some gentle breezes blowing. Because obviously, old school Bollywood obviously has this, and old school Hollywood does as well. That just classic feel to it, where it's not the big rat pack, but like they're the slower ballads. That's just, and there's something it's so comforting, comforting yeah. about that old school audio that has like the, the distortion. Yeah, and it it just almost it's it's the same thing of when you listen to an old vinyl thing and you hear the. Mm -hmm. It's a great, it's comforting just sound. Soothing. Yeah. Uh, and that was just, like I said, it could have, it could have went on because it was just completely relaxing. And I'm sure I would have loved to have subtitles, but you know, yep. we can't always Sorry. have subtitles, guys. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Our subbers work really hard. They can't get to everything. And it's it's unfortunate sometimes because a lot of times they'll do stuff and then it'll get blocked. Yeah. And so they're all the hard work. Obviously, we appreciate it. But uh, we want everybody to be able to appreciate, yeah, yeah, appreciate that, that, on, that on the channel, uh, not just us and Patreon. Yeah. Um, even though we love our Patreon babies, we do very much. But yeah, that was that was beautiful. Yeah, really uh, nice. And I'm I think a lot of people consider him either in the top five or maybe greatest because uh, obviously he was male one of the original vo yeah. male vocalist in in Bollywood history. Obviously, he was on that that list of I believe singers that we did that one time top ten. Singers, I believe, the male or male. I think I think we did a male. We have a video of top ten male vocalists. I believe so. Okay, I think. I could I be wrong. remember. I could be wrong, but uh, he was definitely in there um, with, I believe, you know, Yasudas and SPB and mm -hmm. that's SPB, right? SPB. Um, there's just so many good singers, and again, evidencing. The, you know, ballads out of India, whether it's whatever language it's in, melodically, even their most simple songs are not simple melodically. Mm -hmm. You know, there's always something going on with uh, the melody having bends and variations and some of the middle notes that go in between and the, the Eastern modality. It, it, they're, they're deceivingly, they sound really simple and even their, their simple songs like this, to sing that is not a simple thing to achieve, to accomplish. Oh, no. <laughs> um, we've seen a few, a couple of his, we just a few days ago, we saw the, um, remember this one? That was Colorized? Yes. Uh, yes, I did, yes. He was the singer of that, yep. and then this one, um, oh. Hasina Sufanwali. Uh, we did that a few months ago. Um, that's him as well, and I think We've seen a couple films, though he was the singer I'm sure we of, have. of a few songs. Oh, I'm sure we have. But, obviously, we'd like to um, hear more from him, him being such a yeah. legend, as we want to hear from all the legends, so we can understand and know them when we hear them. Because um, this time last year, we didn't know who SPB was. We didn't but know we're, still, we're still babies. We're not even two yet. Guys, yeah. How old is Bollywood? And that, that's what we're focusing on, not yeah. just India in general. How old is Bollywood? We're very young. We're still babies. <laughs> we've only seen like 130 something <laughs> we've films. We've barely begun to stick our pinky toe in the water. But let us know down below uh, other songs of his that we should react to.